Police in southeastern England have said that people have been arrested at a centre housing migrants and asylum seekers in Folkestone, following a fire and disturbances last week. Kent police were called to a disturbance on Friday at Napier Barracks, a former army facility, now housing migrants and asylum seekers in southeastern England, reported the news agency Associated Press AP. A fire broke out, the on-site canteen was vandalised and windows smashed, according to various press reports. The barracks in the port town of Folkestone are now home to around 400 people. On Friday, police arrested five people in connection with the unrest who remain in custody, reported AP. A further people were arrested. The police suspect that the fire could have been caused by arson. Windows were also smashed during the disturbances. According to police statements, no serious injuries were sustained but a significant amount of damage was caused to one part of the site following a fire. England following a fire at the site. The reported that on Saturday, Kent police were working alongside the Home Office and the Fire Service to establish the full circumstances of what went on and identify any individuals involved. Government report. In the Home Office's Interior Ministry, Equality Impact Assessment, carried out in September, reports the Independent, ministers said that the less generous support provided to asylum seekers was justified by the need to control immigration. The government's own report claims that social distancing is possible in the barracks because the dormitory beds are placed at least two metres apart. They also claim that regular cleaning will take place to reduce. The barracks were last used for British military personnel five years ago, but Chris Philp said that since it had been used for the army it was wrong to say that it is not good enough for asylum claimants. The Home Office made a statement to the new saying that the department was meeting all its statutory duties to accommodate asylum seekers.